what a what a here we go again we are back with some more mystery case files broken arrow if you like these videos please give them a like and a share and if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my youtube channel follow me on twitch mixer and twitter and like my facebook page all of which you can find by searching panda bomb and look for the little bomb with the panda face anyway let's jump back in shall we all right yes we were looking for a shifty morphing object and i believe it's probably behind this guy but he won't go until we go um can you go first i'm new to this ghost chasing business which i don't get because he is a ghost hunter anyway i'm suspicious of that guy it seems I have stumbled into a construction site inside the house. That's what it seems like. Ooh. The deeper I venture inside the house, the closer I am to that clock tower. Uh huh, it all goes down the clock tower. Let's see, there's something morphing in here. Look at that. Is it this bell? It is. Bell into a kettle. And there's a triangle trust. Here, I'm gonna go back and see if I see if he's moved. Ah, he has. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna take that. My ghost Oops. girl! I finally got you in tape! <laughs> oh crap. Wait, what's that in your hand? It's a knife. Oh crap. I wasn't ready for this. Well, Ben just let met his ghost girl face to face. I have to hurry before it ends in blood. Ben's blood. Alright, I was just looking for something shapey shifty. The mechanism is blocked. I guess that happens when a pole gets stuck between the cogs. Oh, is that what that is? I was just looking for the morphing object, y'all. It's probably gonna be this crown. Yeah. Jeez. All right, what's this? Uh, can I use this to pull it out? Ah. Got it. All right, what's this? Glass pieces. Charm bracelet. Burner valve and a syringe top. I'm finished. For, oh, so I didn't move. Okay, I didn't move. They moved. I thought I moved. Okay. Uh, cool. Or not cool for Ben, but cool for me. Let's uh, let's have a look at this uh, here. <clears throat> Expansion of the house demands more raw material than I acquire. Than I can acquire. Thus, I was forced to use everything I found in Jacob's old storage rooms. Huh. There's various odds and ends, like this barrel of medicinal alcohol, but most of it I can use. Alright, this is medicinal alcohol. And, uh, alright. So I'm probably going to use need something to rather that up. I guess we're gonna go look at this old couch. Hmm, let's see. The time is 9.53. Is it now? Hmm. Just a piece of glass. Ah. What is that, like a cog? It's a cog wheel. I got a cog wheel. barrel of alcohol. Alright, that's still the barrel of alcohol. Why does it have three X's on it? That's not that. There's a cogwheel going in this thing here. I don't think any of these is for that. Well, that'd be efficient, I guess. That's what I'm looking for. Service bell. Can I put these back? No. Alright, so our heart goes there. The room just 
move. How can a house shift inside its skin like that? Ooh, it talks like that. All right, what's this? Oh, can I, can I pull this again? Spiral staircase. Oh, so now it just does those two. Okay. This house is a vertible, uh, ver, uh, ver, vertible maze. I don't know what that means. Those stairs lead to nowhere. All right, that looks like five wheel goes here. Let's read this first. Time and again, the experiments end with the same result. The body is just too weak of a vessel. If I wish to succeed in my goal, I will have to find a way to enhance the human condition. Ugh. As the only medical doctor in the family, this must be part of Jacob's research. Yet, what was he trying to achieve? Something's morphing, and I think it's this hook. It was morphing from a hook to an anchor. Sorry, I had to cough. All right, let's pull this. Oh, jeez. That necklace there. I don't know, it's a gear chain. This skeleton was here for a very long time. This isn't their first abduction rodeo. Not by a long shot. Hmm. Wonderful. All right. Um. Yeah, same thing. And I think that's that's it for here. Um, pull this again, I guess. Unfinished room. Does that change when I pull on this? One. No, it doesn't change. It just changes that room. Does this gear chain go here? Aha, it does. And now, we're going to look for items. <clears throat> Let's see. There's a valve for this thing. A plunger head, it looks like. Is that what that is? What's in here? No, it's not a plunger head. It's a MR-16. I know that because I changed those at work. <laughs> And yes, it is a light bulb. Um, a hose. It's like, uh, pliers. Hmm. Pliers on these. <clears throat> Put the light bulb in the hat. Some forceps or tongs. I can't. I don't even know what that is. But whatever it is, we need it. Gas hose. Valve. No, didn't think so. Oh, ooh, matches. Oh, is that what that is? Put that there, light the match. Put some wood on there, okay. All right, now we need some wood. Use, nope, that's a bottle opener gun. That's what I'm gonna need for that. What is that? It's a fuse. Okay, morgue workers shocked. Yesterday, the workers in the Manchester City morgue made a disturbing discovery. Bodies of two children, victims of a fire, disappeared without a trace. Ooh. Bodies of two children stolen from the morgue. Who would do such a deed and why? I know who and, well, I don't know why, but I know who. 
what it has to do with this crazy place. What's going on in here? All right, let's, uh, can we use the tongs to get that? No. Hmm. Got that going. This, maybe? I'm quite confused. Man, I didn't think I could use that for that. Um... Looks like we need a firecracker, which was that thing that was in there. There's a fuse for it. Bottle opener is in that is in the cement mixer here. Or at least that's what that looks like, that is. And uh, we need, I'm assuming, like some kind of wood. Or do I just need to put the fuse in to make it a firecracker? Man. Alright. Really? That's what I need a firecracker for? And boom goes the dynamite. Got the bottom opener. What is that? Lead bars. Ah. Oh, I got a bottle. I gotta put that in there. I'm assuming I need to... Put it in here. No, pour the water in here. And dip that in there. And there we go. We have that thing. It's a Huxley medallion. Because I knew exactly. That's exactly what I needed. Sorry, the yawning has begun. Alright. Ooh! Exploring this labyrinth of a house isn't going to be easy. This is not the room where Meredith took Ben. Nope. It's not. Alright, so that's five. That middle room looked familiar. It looked like um, Ravenhurst after they redid it. But y'all bear with me. Grab my pad and pen, because I am going to mark this. So with these things here, in this configuration. These two chains go to two and five. This configuration it goes to four and one. And then I'm going to assume in this configuration it goes to three. Which is the room I'm looking for. And six. But let's go back to the room where she took me in. Another lost soul has wandered into my home. That's Jane's ghost girl. I've been watching you. Welcome. Uh, yet she doesn't look like a ghost. But she certainly seems more passive now. No, you're not allowed. Why, why am I going to let her stop me? She said, no, you're not allowed. However, there is something morphing. Am I allowed to find that? Is it this owl? It is. All right, let's talk to her. There were others before you. Many of them wasted their lives in vain pursuits. Okay. Prove you're not one of them. Prepare my evening tea. Be warned. It must be perfect. Open the swan drawer. There's a recipe for my favorite herbal tea there. Now 
go. Um, why? Why am I doing this? This is Meredith, I'm sure of it. But she must be centuries old. How? I better not raise... I better not raise her ire, whatever that means. It's tea time, all right. Swan drawer. There's the recipe. Okay. Am I allowed now? Jeez. Library. Indoor garden. Um, poor birdie. It seems it was simply neglected until it ran out of time. Uh, Alright, there's a syringe. What's in the syringe? Measure the precise dosage of milk for the mistress's tea, or prepare to face out dire consequences. Sorry, I uh, have a knee problem. Alright. I have a syringe. And here we are. Put this here, I guess. Uh. Oh, I thought a car was okay. Um, one, two. Buckle my shoe. One. All right. Oh. Uh, this goes there. All right. Indoor garden. Meredith probably spends quality time here when she just gets bored of clocks and abducting people. Right? There's a morphing object here, guys. Let's find it. Real fast. Is it this thing? Yep. It looked out of place, to be honest with you. Alright. Where are we going here? Not here. Yeah, I didn't think that would go here. All right, I guess we'll be back for that. Aha! Grab that. Grab that. Anything else? Let's see what this says. Sparrows love the old bread. I leave them every day. Unfortunately, so do those damn bugs. Repellents I've tried so far. Eucalyptus, distilled water, catnip, lemon and ginger. Mm. We'll go. Grab this lemon. I kind of feel like I needed that lemon. Oops. Yeah, no, that's not creepy at all. Um. Matches. All right, I was certain I was gonna come in here to find the herbs I need. I guess we can go in the library. Oh no, it's Rachel. Rachel, this is this was the final mystery she discovered, and it ended her life. Jacob's ex um, explanation rings true, but I, but I see his eyes that I see in his eyes that. He is hiding something from me. Now I hope, now all hope is lost. <clears throat> I have searched every nook and cranny of our home and they are nowhere to be found. My assistant inspected, my assistant inspected the whole property to no avail. My precious children are nowhere to be found. My world is shattered. 
death certificates for uh, Duncan Jacob Huxley and Fiona Jacob Huxley. 67, April 5th. Death of her children clearly started Meredith on a road to madness, mad road of madness, yet that doesn't explain her current predicament. Meredith will pay for this. Yet I have to be smart about bringing her to justice, or I might end up like Rachel. That's terrible. Terrible indeed. That makes me sad. Well, let's see, it is 9.53. It's still 9.53? I move slow around here. Alright, what we got? Nothing yet. Hop up here. Viciously ravaged portrait. Must be Jacob. Weird things. Weird thing is, those look like knife scratches. Uh-huh. She must be blaming her husband for going crazy. Hmm. Wormwood. <laughs> Yo, I know what wormwood's for. It's not for tea. I can tell you that much right now. Alright. And, um, there's supposed to be like another flower that goes in here, right? No? Yeah, that's it for that. Now turn these pages? No. Missing something? Okay. Let's go back in here. What's this? I'll need some magnets. Some magnets. I don't know what I need to get up there. Is the other thing in here? Okay. No garden library. <clears throat> what was this called? Meredith's Boudoir. I need like a spring. I don't know what I need for this. Not the slightest idea. Y'all, I'm kind of lost. No, you're not allowed. Alright. Where's the other freaking flower? Huh? No. Well, so many clocks, I guess she'll never run out of time. Because of that. I need one more tear. Oh, is there a tear teardrop sitting here? There's a teardrop right there. I guess I gotta figure this out. I, I, I can't take that. I don't have anything that'll. Yeah, 
these aren't for here. Neither is this or this. Y'all, I am... Can I... Go back? Okay, I can. How is this even possible? Someone must have built this maze of rooms for de- Are these maze of rooms for decades? Okay. Staircase. I don't think there are any flowers out here. Oh. Hmm. Okay, I can still go in here. Sometimes things work out exactly as planned. Let's see what is on the scaffold. Yeah, right? Alright, we have a puzzle. Oh, oh this is like Tetris? Just like Tetris. Uh huh, uh huh. Let's reset this. Yes, reset it. Everything's in. That's not in. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, pull this out, pull that out. Can't turn it sideways.
I kind of feel like that needs to go there. It's not in now. Get all the available fields. We'll fill all the available. Oh, you're not in. Okay. Mm. That's it. I think I got it. There we are. It might look shabby, but it'll support my weight. I just hope these aren't my last words. What's this? All this effort for a pressure gauge? Really? Better be worth it. I'm saying. Uh, all right, I'm looking for a flower for crying out loud. That's wrong. I need this one. Don't need a pressure gauge. Oh, I do for this. Oh, daggone it. <laughs> daggone it. Indeed. It's not in here. Can I set this in here somewhere? Got the burner on. I need the other. So I found this herb in a book. What am I missing, y'all? How far back can I go? Can I keep going back? I'll make sure we can't escape the forbidden parts of the house. The only way is forward. That answers that question. <clears throat> There's nothing else to do in here. And... It's the only place I can go. Not sure what goes there. Let's just go there. No. This must be, this must be a shrine to Meredith's deceased children. Yet my gut tells me there are holes in that story. Yeah, I'd say so. All right, this is getting out of hand. Oh yeah, I need a magnet for this. I don't have magnets. Yo!
Okay, I have a field syringe. Um, thought I needed that for the tea. Nope, it just spins and spins, nothing happens. Wrong order, I guess. Alright. Nope. Needed to go here. 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 Here, here, and here. Okay, there's no rhyme or reason to this. It doesn't seem. Is there something that's supposed to? Am I just? Am I missing something? All right, it's got to be that one. What? Are you, are you kidding me? Oh, did I not do this one? Apparently I didn't. Alright. Alright, that little diagram was not helpful. Underground terrarium? They really took its name for granted. Alright, now we're looking for stuff. Before I forget, let's find this other ladybug. There it is. Alright. We're looking for 14. There's a 4 there. I guess we need to find the 1 to go with it. <clears throat> looking for a gold nugget. A uh, chocolate lily. Uh, a gnome, broom, swing, shovel, snail, angel, peacock, handprint, and watering can. Alright, there's the handprint. There's the chocolate lily. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. There's a snail. Is that not the angel? No, nope, there's a gnome. There's the angel shovel, there's a broom, swing, there's a swing, watering can right there, gotta do something to find this peacock, move that I guess, that right, looks nothing like a peacock, but there it is, <clears throat> shovel, shovel, shovel's out in the open, that's not a shovel. But there is something to dig. Where? There. Gold nugget. Right. Number one. Oh, there's the shovel. There we go. Alright. That's what that turns into. Alright. <clears throat> so we got that. Third is to strain it into the cup. did I get? 
did I fill that with? Was that milk? Was that really supposed to be milk? Alright, let's give Meredith her tea. Wonderful. It smells just right. Now I always read with my evening tea. Find my favorite poem in my hairpin. This is a special occasion and I need to look my best. Well, I'll read uh, you the poem before the full hour strikes. Be quick. The clock is ticking. This woman is psycho. All right, guys. Well, since it took us about 40 minutes to make some tea, uh, we'll get her her poem next time. I hope you join me. And if you like this video, please give it a like and a share. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my YouTube font channel. Follow me on Twitch Mixer and Twitter. And also like my Facebook page. Um, if, they, if you're wanting to interact with me, I can tell you now. Facebook and Twitter are the two best ways. Anyway. I hope to see you guys next time, and until then, deuces gooses.